Hey guys, Splinter Films here, and today I just got a new Nerf gun, and I'm going to be opening it, unboxing it, and reviewing it. So I'm gonna go get a knife, and I'm gonna go open it. So I've got my knife. I'm gonna open the side first. Just go right down the middle. Make sure to always cut away from yourself when you're cutting something open. Because if, if you don't, then you may cut yourself, which would not be fun. This is a really tough box. And it says frustration free. Video is going to be too long to email. I'm not emailing it. Today. Oh. Ah, I think I'm going to go get a better knife. Oh. Try some scissors. So I've got Can this. Look for me too. Who's the video for? YouTube. YouTube. Oh, okay. Boring so far. Um, Make sure to drop a like on the video. That would help me a lot. Let's go for three likes. It's a really big like goal, but I think we can do it. Um, make sure to subscribe for more nerf related videos like this. And um, I'm almost, I've almost got this box open. Why don't you start from now? <laughs> Sorry, um, it's taking so long. But this box is supposed to be. Why don't you restart it? Oh, I got this open. Yes. All right. Now I just need to get this part. I just rip this over in my hand. Okay, here we are. With the modulus. Oh, I see it. Alright. Here it is. It's the Nerf Modulus. Upside down. Upside down. But it's still good to see. So, got this right here. Probably just take this out. And first, I'm going to take out the extensions first. I think that would be good. So, I'll just rip this box. Part open. Dang, this said we're frustration free. I don't think so. Oh, Alright, there we go. Got the drop grip. Right there. And next, I'll do the stock. Get it started with my hands and then rip it open. stock. I thought it looked like it was adjustable, but it's not. So put the stock there. And then right here I've got the bullets. Uh, even though I have a lot more, but this will, I guess, help. And um, next we've got the, the double rail, um, what's it called? I can't think of the name. The Suppressor, that's what you would call on the real gun, I don't know what it is on their film. But there we got that. That was pretty easy to open. Um, let me try and get the scope out. There's something on the bottom. Oh, there we go. That was pretty easy. Here we go. 
show the scope. Oh. It's pretty good. Thought it would be better. Thought it would be like a sniper scope. But you know, this isn't a sniper. Or it could be. But I don't think there's a fully automatic sniper in the world, so. Or I mean semi automatic sniper. Wait, yeah there is. I am stupid right now. Alright, so here we go. This is the actual gun. Um, it says to put AA batteries in somewhere. I don't know where. Oh, I see it right here. And here we've got the banana magazine. Right here, holds 10, holds 10 bullets. Um, doesn't actually, I don't think it actually rounds. I'm not sure. So let's add all the extensions to it, and then I'll add the batteries and see what it looks like. So first, I'll do the scope. Stop! That was my dog. He drinks way too much water, and then he throws up, so. It's kind of stupid. But, he's a young dog. All this good, um, stock is kind of bendy a little bit. It's kind of weird. So let's add the suppressor. Stop! Right! Stop! Right! Stop! God, that's awesome. And then, finally, we have got the drop grip. Then we will have to... Right! Right! Stop! And there isn't any more left. I'm sure this is not Oh, it's the wrong way. You need them outside running around for a while. Right here, thirsty. the complete modulus. Alright, now, this is the whole thing. Right here. Um, right here. And I'm going to add the, the stop, or the uh, magazine. And then I'll get a screwdriver and put the AA batteries in. So you got steak. You got steak. Yeah. I got ground beef. Yeah. Oh, and there's chicken too, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. And then you almost got it unscrewed. No. I got it unscrewed. So I'm going to go right. get the batteries and I'll be right back. See here, I've got four AA batteries. I don't know if you can see that well, but I'm gonna put these in. And hopefully, that white one isn't dead. That would suck. Here, got this. Oh, kind of hard. There we go. The first one. Put the spring. The spring setting first. I think it's this way? No. Is it this way? I'm not sure. So let's see if this works. It works! Alright, so now I'm just going to put this back on. I'm going to screw it back on. I'm going to screw it back on and. I'll show you the test fire. Alright, um, this worked really well when I was on screen. Okay, here we go. I got it going. I recommended your services to my daughter. Oh, I have to do that side. Alright. 
That makes sense. Oh, I'm done. Okay, here we go. Now it should be working. If I could just get this right. And I believe she is now using you. Alright, I've got it very tight. Let me um, open these bullets up and put them in the clip and then I'll test fire it at the camera. That would be pretty cool. So here we go. One, two, I'll just take them all out. Here we go. Take them all out. Yep. All of them. Are there any bad Put them in the right way. Oh. Oh, oh. Thank you. No. Star gets everything. You almost ate one of these nerf darts. Two more. Oh, three more. All right now, two more. And last one. All right, here we go. We have a full magazine. Has completely. And um, if your arm is too short for this, then you could. Right. Like if your arm is too short to extend all the way out here, then. You could just hold it like this right here. It's gonna be easier. So I don't get the point of the jump grip. Oh, yeah, gosh, I think it's stuck. oh, there we go. Still looks good with the jump grip. Can you hear that? That's it. so much for watching make sure to subscribe for more and drop a like comment and i'll see you guys in the next one